Okay, what's going on, people? It's Fur here. Now, before I start the video, I gotta give a shout out to Mugiwara Matt B because we were talking about this topic and we kind of came up with this crazy idea, just rambling, you know, just speculation and all of that. And it might, it, it turned out to be kind of a legit theory that we kind of just came up together with. So, you know, shout out to him. Okay, so what I'm gonna be talking about today is Big Mom's potential power application she could possibly have. Now, the soul soul fruit is hacks in its own regard, but with the right application, her hacks is can like go to a whole different level. Some of you guys probably know where this is going. Now, from what we know so far, Big Mom's ability allows her to take and give uh, souls to objects. So things like ball, a ball of fire and like lightning. So Zeus and Prometheus and like the homies. Basically, she can give life to anything and, you know, humanize them. It also it seems like there's levels to these souls as well. Maybe the more souls she puts into an object the stronger it is for example king boom is like a superior version of the homies and zeus and prometheus were said to be on a whole different level because since they were a part of big mom's very own soul amongst the current yonkos and the only jolly roger i never understood was big mom's jolly roger now a jolly roger can see a lot about someone's crew if you look at it not all of them but you know just some of them for example kaido's flag could mean he said he was some kind of experiment because it's similar to like the world government's uh, giantification symbol that was on punk hazard and it's a lot similar to the giant giant pirates crew flag as well and blackbeard having three skulls knowing blackbeard as like a devil fruit hunter that could mean he has he's looking for three devil fruits or end game he might have three devil fruits and it's the same with capone and hawkins Th these two guys their flag basically hints at their own devil fruit now if you look at big mom her jolly roger kind of represents the four elements the yellow swirl could be fire which is prometheus the gray swirl could be air or wind which is zeus and following the the whole greek theme that big mom already has the blue swirl could be poseidon or some other water god um because you know poseidon uh shira hoshi is already poseidon but you know she doesn't control the sea she controls the sea kings but yeah big mom's poseidon would control the water or the sea which could be hacks on its own like just controlling the sea that's crazy and the tree would be gaia gaia would control the earth or the trees which we saw like the homies but you know their their souls are going to be on like on a whole different level now if big mom can control the sea that's game over for a lot of devil fruit users except the very few like kuzan you know these people that can like get around sea water in a way and she would be on some avatar stuff you know controlling all the elements at her will and this would be devastating for devil fruit users but you know people might think it's two hacks but if you look at the other yonkos they have their own overpowered abilities as well so i wouldn't be surprised if she's capable of doing this and if my memory serves me right oda stated that there, there was not going to be a water devil fruit in the series and i can see why he says that because the water controlling ability in the series would be a sub ability from somebody else so you know big mom controlling the sea might just be Oda's answer to that question and big mom having this ability would mean like she can match up against anybody in the series so if someone has an ability she would just use the opposite of that ability so big mom has the most versatile devil fruit in the series for example if a devil fruit user comes to her she would just use poseidon and just wreck him and if a hockey user tries to like fight her and some type of way zeus and prometheus would just go ham and from what we know zeus and Prometheus prometheus can't even be hurt with hockey unless you have a soul power like brooke so you know it, it's getting kind of crazy with big mom now the big problem here is that seawater counteracts the effects of a devil fruit user now me and theory 32 we were talking about this and he wasn't even sure himself but he said can big mom put a soul in a sea stone spear or a sea stone cuffs or anything so the main question here is does sea stone nerf the offset of a devil fruit so for example can hancock turn sea stone into actual stone with her ability and i don't i really don't see why the only rule we know about devil fruit so far being nerfed is only when the user is being touched by sea stone on a physical level they themselves have to be touched with the sea stone not their offset of a devil fruit so the offset of a devil fruit probably wouldn't be i don't think it's going to be countered by actual sea stone so i wouldn't be surprised if big mom was capable of affecting the seawater she is a yonker after all and big mom also has this theme with the devil fruit where she's basically the mother of everything and following the greek theme that she already has with zeus and prometheus gaia was essentially the greek god who gave birth to all the other gods so zeus and prometheus they're all uh, sons and daughters of gaia and each of them possess different abilities so if big mom signifies gaia 
that would make sense if she can control all the elements so that's that's just a quick mention but anyways comment down below like share as far as space do you think big mom can put a soul in a body of water or like the sea obviously it's gonna be it's not the entire sea it's just like an area where she can control you think it's possible comment down below and i will see you guys later peace